Hello everyone, and welcome to my Bachelor official YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. Bob Guinea, a former cast member of The Bachelor, is against Jerry Turner and Theresa Nist's divorce decision. Three months ago, the Golden Bachelor couple exchanged vows. See where Bob Guinea believes the ex-couple went wrong by reading on. Bob Guinea is not new to drama in relationships. Bob Guinea has been involved with Bachelor Nation virtually since its inception. He was a participant on season one of The Bachelorette when viewers first got to know him. He and Trista Sutter are still close friends, even if she went with someone else. Bob Guinea was chosen for the fourth season of The Bachelor because of his popularity with fans. Despite not becoming engaged, he concluded his season in a relationship with competitor Estella Gardenier. Soon after the season concluded, they called it quits. A few months after The Bachelor, in 2004, he wed Rebecca Buttig, an actress from All My Children. Before their amicable divorce in 2010, the pair was wed. They didn't have any kids. Bob Guinea married Jessica Canyon in 2016, and the two of them had two kids together. Bob Guinea, who has experience with divorce, offered his opinions on the unexpected divorce of Theresa Nist and Jerry Turner, the golden bachelor couple. Alum of Bachelor Slams, the divorce decision of Jerry and Theresa. He appeared on an almost famous podcast episode with Ashley Iaconetti, the star of Bachelor Nation, and Trista Sutter, his past love interest. The talk of the town was Jerry and Theresa. Bob Guinea and Ashley I were less supportive of the former pair, despite the fact that numerous franchise alumni spoke out in favor of them. According to the former Bachelor, the couple was fundamentally flawed from the jump. You don't let someone spend a couple million dollars on your wedding and have it televised for the entire world to see, only to let it fall apart so quickly, he reasoned. Just two months after the world witnessed their engagement on the Golden Bachelor final, Jerry Turner and Theresa Nist tied the knot in January 2024. Bob Guinea chastised the pair for surrendering so quickly. If you really love that person, you don't make that step without trying everything you possibly can. I can say as someone who went through a divorce, he continued, feels that Theresa and Jerry could have done more. What more could they have done, then? Bob Guinea proposed that perhaps their marriage should never have happened in the first place. Regarding the divorcing couple's hasty trip to the altar, he suggested, maybe pump the brakes. Theresa and Jerry argue that their divorce was brought on by their separate state residences. Both of them opposed leaving their families behind. Bob Guinea says that's hardly a reason to get a divorce. Perhaps they should just take a few minutes and try to salvage this whole thing, he opined. Overall, the former Bachelor star does not believe that their divorce was brought on by their separation. Echoing Nick Wilde's remarks on the matter, he remarked, I have a hard time accepting the fact that they weren't going to live together is why they're getting divorced. Do you concur with Bob Guinea that Theresa and Jerry should have given it more effort to keep their marriage intact? Post your thoughts in the Jerry, comments. 72 and Theresa, 70, announced on Friday that they would be filing for divorce. They still think that one day they will discover true love. The couple was questioned about whether they would still look for love after their breakup on Good Morning America. Oh yeah, the original Golden Bachelor said. Yes, and we tell everyone else to continue to look for love, she replied. You know I still love you. Jerry turned to face his ex-wife, to which she responded, And I still love you. The ABC pair said on Friday that after just three months of marriage, they would be calling it quits. Theresa and I have had a number of heart-to-heart -heart conversations, and we've looked closely at our living situation, they stated to GMA. 
We've come to the decision mutually that it's probably time for us to dissolve our marriage. Jerry and Theresa had declared to the world just three months before that they could not envision their lives apart. The TV personality said that their families were the driving force behind any changes. What really stands out to me from our chats is how committed we both are to our families. I think we just feel like it's best for the happiness of each of us to live apart. They searched for a house in New Jersey and South Carolina, but they couldn't decide where to move. Theresa admitted to the Golden Bachelor that she would have to give her ring and dress back because they had decided not to forward with their marriage. Jerry said, but you know, we won't have to give back the memories. The restaurant owner asserted at the conclusion of the talk that even after choosing to move on, they still love each other. The news of the split infuriated fans, who vented their annoyance on X a number of them, even acknowledged that the news didn't surprise them. One yelled, what a joke. Astonished, why are people watching this at all? Inquired another. I anticipated this would occur. A third ripped, saying they didn't even live together. What an incredible 927 hours they had. A fourth person jokingly wrote. Cease to exist, golden bachelor. A fifth begged, shouldn't have rushed the wedding. Keep up with the most recent updates and tales about the bachelor. This past January, Jerry and Theresa exchanged foes at the La Quinta Resort and Club in Palm Springs, California, amid a star-studded event. Three months after being married, the pair was still living apart, according to reports that surfaced only last week. According to TMZ, the financial services expert continues to live in New Jersey, while the ABC star continues to work out of his lake estate in northern Indiana. Their decision to stay apart was mostly motivated by the challenges of relocation, an insider informed the site. They've each got their own established homes in their respective states, and moving everything into one pad would be time-consuming, said the insider. After their initial meeting in August, Jerry proposed to Theresa during the inaugural season of The Golden Bachelor's November 30 final. The couple was questioned about whether they would still look for love after their breakup on Good Morning America. Oh yeah, the original Golden Bachelor said. Yes, and we tell everyone else to continue to look for love, she replied. You know I still love you, Jerry turned to face his ex-wife, to which she responded and I still love you. The ABC pair said on Friday that after just three months of marriage, they would be calling it quits. Theresa and I have had a number of heart-to-heart -heart conversations, and we've looked closely at our living situation. They stated to GMA. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.